to a day in life, Yagra Bell, and last week's book on my channel. Today is October 4th. Third video log for today. Third video log, guys. And yes, it's still raining out there. And I'm going to continue on from what I was talking about in the last video. Um, I don't know, I was talking about freak storms and the weather's being weird and talking about this and that. I don't know. Um, I don't know, let's move on to something else. Let's talk about... Okay, let's continue uh, uh, do the end recap of you no. Know, let's talk about that at least. You know, being the third video, uh, talking about avatar sites and stuff like that. And, you know, being in role plays, uh, RP role plays, and some things get pretty serious. And people put you know a bunch of you know time and money and their life into certain things like that. And this virtual world is like um, a lot of things you can't do outside that you can do in there. You can do anything and everything in there, you know, there's still some consequences and you know, reactions and stuff. If you're in role plays and multiple role plays and try not to do cross role plays and some people don't want to, you no, know, these days they don't want to, you know, talk about real life and the role play is different and then you can't, can't have the role play into real life and, you know, try not to cross this and that. But anyway, moving on to talking about uh, what I was talking about the other day. Um role playing. I'm trying to think of what I was talking about yesterday. Um, I don't know, going to, uh, the, well, you know, second family and trying to fit in and do this and that. And then at that time I was getting to, into like different jobs. Uh, oh, well, okay. Let's finish off what I was talking about and before. I just remembered now. Uh, this person came up to me and, you know, I didn't really know him. I guess he was known by other people and he's been in multiple role plays. And he asked me if I wanted to be a part of his family. And I would like to um, give you the higher rank if you accepted me to be your father. And being that, being a blood father, and there's a way to do that to be reborn or um, have a blood ceremony or something like that. And in the lines, I mean, you know, being fresh up, being just a king and then being happy with the king and uh, being in a relationship and, you know, that thing kind of you now fell under, you know not really feeling like being the king and, you know, changing my name again and, you know, still being the king, you know, still. And I was like, thinking about that and you know, I was talking it over with, um, you know, the first mother and so that. She was on sometimes and not really. And then, you know, well, that's just, she's up to you. She was a good lady. She was a, a Wiccan lady and, um, she was a good lady, and, you know, I still talk to her, and I still call her mother, because, you know, she was the first mother in the, in the game, or the end of the, the virtual world of avatars. And, so, you know, I accepted, and I got a new, new mother, new father, and uh, became emperor, and I had, you know, other brothers and sisters, and, you know, had to you know, come about there, and so that, and the, the second family, you know, that went from one place to another and then got, you know, uh, involved in another group of people and, you know, we had, we had our, our father and mother and, you know, a sister and a brother, you know, kind of like, um, not like, like sister-in-law and, uh, no, actually, no, sister, and he was a brother-in-law. He was, he was wicked and I had all I do to say he's demented in the virtual world that he is in real life. He was a uh, demented soul in both worlds, and, and it's tough to even talk about it right now. We might get into that maybe a little bit later. But being a part of this new uh, thing, you know, new clothes, a new outfit, new way of life, and I started, you know, to even get you know, a name change token to her, a new life, a new name. And, you know, everything was good and, good and cool and stuff like that, and, you know, I was happy, you know. New mother, and she was really good, you know, talked with her and stuff, and... Uh, you know, and she had, you know, a bunch of sons and daughters and, you know, things was cool and, you know, accepting this new father. But then, you know, little by little to learn that he was, um, he's been in different role plays, he's been in different, uh, families and, you know, he's screwed up different things and, you know, he's, he's bad and role playing and, and a bad person to, to begin with. And, <laughs> always doing just dumb things and getting kicked out of those families. So everything was going pretty good, you know, I think it went on for about maybe three months to six months and then kind of died out and then, you know, the wicked, you know, brother, uh, you, know, and, you know, trying to, you know, 
in, in between, you know, the new uh, family life and the, you know, second family, you know, me, uh, was, didn't know exactly where it still belonged in, you know, it's, you know, it's a new, new thing, new beginnings and stuff like that, and it was, you know, doing this and that, and it was, it was kind of the time that I would, to do something different. And this time, you know, I decided to overstep my uh, boundaries and stuff and the second family and I said, I, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to the way this role play is going and stuff like that. I mean, they didn't say it just like that, but I was like, you know, somebody was getting disciplined and uh, and uh, they did something wrong, I guess, and it wasn't really that big a deal, but, you know, the uh, brother-in-law, he was just dumb. Uh, on things, and he wanted his role play one way, not another way. And uh, you know, anybody who doesn't know follow him, he's gonna he's gonna kill him, and he was gonna kill somebody. I got in the way, and I decided to take the knife, and I decided to you know to really uh, to die. That was the first, maybe second death, I think, maybe second death. But that wasn't the end of my my role playing and stuff like that. I decided to take a, you know like a whole month of being between uh, the afterlife and the uh, the real life to between like to be in a limbo for a month I decided to you know to do some kind of role play like that and the only person that could I would really let in is you know my my real or my you know blood sister and the new blood mother because the new blood father was you know alongside with the uh, brother in law who later became, you know, his son and then became my brother, my blood brother. Don't even ask me how that really happens or, you know, what's going on. And, you know, slowly the second roleplay family are kind of, you know, thinning out and going doing their thing. They're just bull crap and it's like, oh, you know, you're doing this and doing that. How is that possible, you know? Uh, and, and uh, you know, me dying in this virtual world didn't really mean I died because... Uh, it was pulling me back to the, you know, the, the role-playing because uh, I had unfinished business. Me having a new wife brought into the, the second family, and, you know, do this, this, and that, you know, and it's gone like two or three months, stuff, and then I decided to, you know, uh, marry because, you know, I'm going to have wolf cubs with this lady, I think six to eight wolf cubs. New, uh, you know, wife and stuff. And that, the wife thing was cool, and doing the, you know, the wife thing and husband thing, you know, and... You know, doing these pups, but I, they weren't born just yet. So, coming down to, I don't know, at the end of the month, and then she's going to be having these pups. This is between, you know, like a, a wolf kind of point of view and a vampire, you know, having uh, hybrid pups. So, you know, dragged on, dragged on, dragged on, and then I decided to be, to be reborn, you know, have a new body. And then I'm going to be stronger, take on the bigger roles, and doing uh, you know the virtual life and, and and have fun and stuff. So I came back, you know, um, to 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 a new body and a new life, and then I was stronger than I was before. To have more knowledge and more role playing stuff, and I was doing this and this and that, and and it, it, it seemed right and it seemed cool. So when I came into this virtual world, I never became human. I was never a human. I was a fallen angel, and then from there, you know, fallen angel, you know, um, my uh, story was I, you know, I was a fallen angel. I was in, I was living in heaven, and I fell in love with a woman from hell, and she got kicked out of hell, and I got kicked out of heaven. I crashed into this uh, this virtual universe, which became you know new role playing stuff like that, and me trying to find out where this this uh, woman is, and you know, this was like the, the first first woman. This is the first uh, girlfriend in there, you know. I think we married and stuff like that. I don't actually know we didn't marry, and you know we didn't really have my kids and marriage. Like that I wasn't really into that world role play kind of life. And she was like really like, demonic and you know, goth and of a devil and stuff like that. And it's like you know, that fits in my role play because I'm trying to figure out, you know, trying to you know, uh, find a certain person to actually play that. And she you know, she played that pretty damn well. So me. Um, you know, throughout the thing, you know, how I, you know, did the story thing in you know, six months to a year and then found out this person. Actually, uh, to to tell you the truth, you know, the first two years I was, you know, the thing and stuff like that and nothing really was going on like that and I was bored and stuff like that. And I let it go for about, you know, a year. And then, um, 
came back I think a year later and realized that I was I was hacked can't get in my avatar couldn't get the thing they couldn't do anything you know it belonged to somebody else and people were on that person was on daily and stuff like that and I haven't been on there for about a year and you know, it's a, a guarantee about a year and that's when you know the role play life and stuff like that and things change and a uh, new avatar look and you know uh, clothing and uh, things and role plays so I never did any role plays I never did none of that stuff just hanged out and listened to music and stuff hanging with it but anyway the one who was, who was a, became a father was really an old friend from when we sat in a wolf room and listened to music stuff. Um, my character was Black Wolf and he was Red Wolf. And uh, before that he was like country guy or something, some kind of country guy and then he became Blue, uh, Red Wolf. And I was Black Wolf and you know, we became friends in time. And then later on, you know, like uh, three years later, you know, we bumped into each other again and then really realized, you know, later on, I think by the fourth year of this thing, no, two years, uh, okay, no, two years, one year, okay, yeah, fourth year back into it, and then I think by the fifth year we figured out, you know, that we knew each other, it's like looking back at his name changes and blah, 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 but anyway, going back to uh, the role play thing, um, came in a new body and, you know, new, uh, my old soul in a new body and became stronger and stuff, and I had to come back because the wife, you know, was going to have pops and I wanted to be back for it, and I surprised her, it was back, and some people were pissed off because, you know, it's the same, you know, uh, soul, different body, and it's like, when am I doing back stuff? And that, that kind of stirred up things because uh, the role play world is not really set in stone, in stone because there's different ways and there's rules and stuff like that. But later on, there's different rules. And, you know, me being the, the fallen angel of my soul is, you know, is uh, like more angelic and, you know, not really any kind of demon stuff and that. Uh, anyway, talking about uh, also the other woman, she, you know, her and I you know, did things for about a year and stuff like that, or no, actually you no, know, three months, six months, and then she kind of disappeared. You know that role play thing, you know, was done. It was fun, you know, dance around and having fun and stuff like that. And she, she was demonic, and I was like really angel, like kind of like a, you know, a ancient angel kind of thing. Anyway, um, so you know, being there, being a part of the, uh, the wife and the wolf cubs and stuff like that, and you know, a bunch of names and stuff and. I didn't. Some people weren't liking that I had a, a good life and I was you know, doing role play really good and uh, I was more royal like and I was doing like different jobs. I was um, a security guard, DJ, uh, healer, um, um, a soul searcher. You know, somebody who's you no know, who's uh, who also was lost between worlds, between uh, um, living and dead and. Um, to bring the soul back to be reborn and it was doing something like that. I, I mean, I, I got better and better at the role plays and stuff. And, you know, we st uh, still together for about, you know, uh, three to six months and then we had other more pops and, you know, changed my name again and, you know, role plays started different. And then this lady just disappeared and then I, you know, got involved with another uh, you know, lady and she was really good and, and you know, uh, I had another friend from like the, like the, the third year uh, in, I didn't see for like a couple years, and then got together, and then this other uh, friend had come about, and then I make another different friend stuff. Anyway, I must wrap it up and talk about it in the next video. If you guys, you like this video? Please do hit the like button. Please subscribe to me. Make sure this video on the channel might be for you, might be for me. Please do tell your friends and family about me. Thank you for the interview. Thank you for the time I watch it. Hope you have a nice day. More than that, remember it's better to be average than original.